Christ. Welcome back, everybody. We'll get started here in just a bit. Got a few new things I want to share. A new campaign, if you can't tell already, from above my head. In this scene, it should be above my head. Um, just a few updates, a few announcements. But in terms of the actual gameplay, we're back to Final Fantasy 16. I'm hoping to be finished with this soon. Because I know uh, Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League is uh, coming out. I think I have a three-day early access to it. And so I'm, I'm planning to stream that. I've seen a lot of mixed reviews about it. Um, I actually didn't I didn't even uh, sign up to try the, uh, the closed beta. You know, I just didn't. And uh, it looks fun. I'm, I'm hoping we'll like it on stream. So. But that's what's next. Uh, we'll, we'll get into that, like, more as we get to the... Uh, get to the end of Final Fantasy 16 so like let's not worry about what's next let's worry, worry about like what's happening right now and that's some Final Fantasy 16 here Jordan got into the habit if, if you know you know if you've been here a while you know I like to kind of pin just a small message in the chat and I also keep I also keep the Twitch creator dashboard and tree manager open. I actually prefer it open as well alongside OBS. But yeah, we've got about three minutes and uh, we'll get on over to it. Uh, last thing I remember from the last stream, we did a three-part main quest, which was, uh, it took the entire hour of the stream to do it. And so now we're uh, headed back to the hideaway. Uh, and we'll, again, we'll get started in just a few minutes. get so scared uh even with like the locked docks in obs i get so scared like touching anything because i don't want to <laughs> i don't want to mess up anything you know like i actually uh start these sometimes like 30 minutes early usually 15 but if i'm feeling kind of like when i had the issue going on with my camera i was starting like 30 minutes early just to kind of test everything and make sure everything was working as it should within obs the weather's been weird here lately like i think my ac's on so I'm kind of, and I'm wearing like this athleisure stuff. So I'll turn my fan off, which I'm pretty sure like I'll need to turn it back on like really soon. But it's like blowing right on me as, as the AC's on. All right, preparing to give Odin the beat down. That's uh, that's what I'm assuming. That's what I'm assuming. I know we saw him a few streams ago, and it's uh, heavily implied that he's going to be the next dominant that we face. Oh. Okay. Yeah, uh... In about a minute or so, I'll get into the uh, new campaign we have running up above me there. So, there's my. Okay. Wait, wait a minute. Okay. Yeah, that's. Uh, I could I hear my son in the other room. And that, oddly enough, made me uh, think to check my audio mixer to make sure my mic. <laughs> And my capture card was capturing the sound from the game. So. But yeah, it looks like we're good. Everything's looking good. We'll get started here in just about 30 seconds.
Alright, let's switch on over to live. Live, everybody. Alright, and before we get started, I just want to, you know, give a shout out to Stream Elements for allowing me to do these uh, campaigns and the uh, sponsorships. So, uh, the next sponsor for the next couple of weeks or so, it's uh, Puzzles and Survival. Uh, you know, it uh, costs you nothing. It, like, literally directly supports me. So, if you see it in the chat, or if you see it, like, it's usually above me. Like, for this scene and our live scene, it's literally above me. If you scan that QR code and use my link, just just you downloading it supports the channel. Uh, and I, I use, like, all the, all the income I make, you know, from the channel will be going directly to, like, you know, equipment, you know, uh, workstations, video games to stream, you know, things like that just to bring better content to you guys and better the uh, setup also just a few incentives if you guys do participate in the uh, campaign send me a picture of you doing so either in the chat or the discord link in the discord is on my twitch page and I will either do a one-on-one -on -one with you in a MOBA because we do plan on starting to stream MOBAs very soon it will be the uh, smite 2 and the predecessor or paragon MOBA or if that's not your cup of tea, I will let you choose the next single player playthrough or session of a playthrough. So if even if we're in the middle of a playthrough, and if you support these like campaigns or sub, I could I could like stop the next or reschedule the next playthrough and play a single player game of your choice if the MOBA is not to your liking. So again, just uh, check the chat periodically or use the QR code above me and give that game a try at no cost to you. So. Without further ado, let's do this. All right. So, where did you learn to swing a sword like that? Okay, so yep. In a desert the last part of this mission was here in the Dalamil Inn, in the man. desert area. Shouldn't be too hard to track down Kara's collector. So now only thing we have to do is go back to the hideaway and again that was a three-part story mission that was kind of wild okay ooh a new missive uh, we won't we won't need to check that yet but I do know what we should check let's not uh, check I know we've been doing a lot of side quests along this playthrough as well so let's check what what is her name Desiree, I keep forgetting her name. Welcome to the Patron's Whisper. Is everything we've received and everything? Ah, oh, nice. We got enough for this High Cleric's medallion. All yours. Here, one second, everyone. Sorry about that, everybody. It's uh, I I could just feel that the mic was picking that up, but uh, my son likes to have a little too much fun when it's time for daddy to stream. So, so anyway, we had enough renown to claim this. It's a high cleric medallion. It's a purple rarity. Oh, I wish we could see what's next. Uh, actually, if you think about it, with the way we're like doing these uh missions, we're not that far off, even though it seems like a lot. With what's that, one twenty? to go but not that far off I gave you that one didn't I here let me let's actually go ahead and check that what is that it would be here healing potency by 40 nice okay I'm looking at the wrong one again so that one increases the healing potency of high potions I feel like I tend to like use the let's see gill earned Ah, oh, no, I don't want to take that off. I wonder if there's like some sort of like side quest that will allow us to slot just one more accessory. Was wondering when you turn up. Mm. 
At our small our friends thanking you for your timely intervention. Intervention. How is it you always, always such a just the right moment? Look, pretty I, stern I, word. Any word on the rest of the realm? Hmm, let's see. Storm's still crying out for mother crystals. The nations are still in chaos. And the skies are still the color of a kick in the kidneys two days on. So Right. Five. We knew this was gonna happen. Well, not the bleeding skies part. But you take my point. Now's not the time to second guess yourself. Now's the time. That's fair. Uh, guys, if you know, you know. If you've been following for a while, you know I try my best not to talk during the cutscenes. So, uh, for all you new people out there, if I get quiet, it's because I'm trying to not talk during the cutscene. So, it was not Sylvester, but Olivier, who served as Ultima's puppet. And when Dion learned of this, he sought to slay the fiend. Only for his father to take the spear that would have freed him. Enough to drive a man that's, uh, into madness. That's Dion, right? Uh, Bahamut. He hasn't stirred. I would be afraid to wake. Had I but reached out to him sooner, warned him of the threat Ultima posed. But now, both an empire and her prince lie broken. Joshua. What do you know of Ultima? We know he's thirsty for Clive. Very little, I'm afraid. Despite my best efforts. Eighteen years ago, as I lay buried beneath the rubble of Phoenix Gate, it was not death who came for me, but another. And it was while in my rescuer's care, I first heard of Ultima. I've been chasing his shadow ever since. Ultima by some deep, dark purpose, and for whatever reason, it would seem you are crucial to his designs. He will stop at nothing to have you. Yeah, I can't wait to see how that fight goes down when that time comes. Why me? What possible use could I be to such a creature? Hmm. That is one of many answers that have eluded me. Yeah, I'm kind of wondering to see what's up with that too. It is not mere chance. So you could choose any other icon, like what, why he freed. Or maybe it's uh, got something to do with Clyde's ability to kind of like absorb the powers from the other icons. Power that is at once acutely limited. I wield fire, and only fire. And I only ice. Eight wardens for eight elements. You, Clive. Yeah, see, okay, I called it. <laughs> you are different. You are special. Your abilities begin with the flames of Ifrit, but they do not end there. The fact Ifrit can even exist goes against everything we thought we knew of dominance. Yeah, so it's like two Perhaps fire dominance. Ultima has been waiting for one such as you, whose potential is truly limitless. I've encountered that thing several times now. If it or he, as you say, needs me, why hasn't he claimed me as he did the boy? Were I to hazard a guess, questions that need answers, right? <laughs> I'd say the two of you are somehow incompatible. His mind's not properly attuned to your body. Hmm. His mind. Mind, awareness, spirit, call it what you wish. But I believe Ultima to be an embodiment of the concept. Okay. Is why I struggle and fail to contain him here inside me. Sorry. Inside you. With every setting sun, I feel my strength wane. And though the Phoenix's flames mend the prison I have made for Ultima, mm. they do so at a cost. We must find a means to bring an end to him. Before I meet my own. What were you thinking? It was that or let him take Clive. I've left subtle, my brother. But that doesn't mean you should sacrifice yourself to save me.
Joshua. Oh, man. Clyde, it's Gav. There's an army of Akashic at the gates of Canva. Canva, Canva. Is that, I think that's like where we sent him, right? Gav, him being Gav. What's the short of it? Oh, it's all tired, told you. The capital of the free cities is under siege by an army of monstrosities. Mm. The city guard are doing their best to stem the tide, but numbers ain't on their side. What of Lord Byron and Mid? Were they able to escape? No, but they're all right for now. They're hiding with Gav at midship. We have to get them out of there. And we shall. Otto, prepare a stolas. <laughs> Tell Gav to stay exactly where he is. Understood. Vivian, what's the swiftest route to the free cities? <laughs> that sounds like a question for the map. Oh, I love, I love Look these. Here. I love it when she does these. This road, through Tabor, should provide the least trouble. Good. Oh, I thought she was like going to go uh, super Tabor in detail exactly again. Joshua, bed is where you should be bound. You don't think I told him the exact same thing? Was I not such a talented healer? I would surely have been inclined to agree. But thanks to her ministrations, I feel I may safely rejoin my attendant, who was to wait for me in Tabor if we became separated. All right, we travel together. Clive. If he stays close to me, he'll be fine. Thank you. Okay, this is gonna be good. Is he gonna be able to fight alongside us? Let's see. New quest available. Yeah, I know like uh, I'm usually doing those, the uh, side quests, but uh, I'm actually gonna uh, focus on the uh, story right now. Since I feel like I've taken so long to finish Final Fantasy 16. And uh, like I said, I plan on streaming the Suicide Squad Kill the Justice, Justice League next. And I don't wanna be like late on that, so. So I'll focus on story for a while. Go on then. Okay, I don't think. Yeah. Wait a minute. What's that? I feel like I, I say that every stream, and it's it's the thing that I keep forgetting about. It like lets you automatically charge your uh, spells. You'll not find a better person, which I'm like, eh. Like I feel like I haven't learned to, or I haven't forgotten to like not charge them yet. So it's not a big deal. <laughs> but I'm if I'm being honest, I just don't want to drop the. Uh, the 20k <laughs> okay anything i can reinforce okay yeah we got all that mm -hmm. and i'm getting all that yeah i don't think there's like anything new right now yep wait a minute tricks oh yeah i forgot this is from the the Drake Slayer stuff is from the the mission. Do I want to do that? You know what? Why not? Here, let's let's do this. Last year and equip it. And let's see if it lets me reinforce them, or can they be reinforced? I don't believe so. But you know what? At least we were able to get it on. Uh, we can't do the belt because it looks like we need to do another bounty. That uh, icon there next to that Electrum item that we're missing. That's from a bounty monster. So we can't do that yet. Anyway. Alright. It says, uh, travel to the Crossjet Echoes. Let's go ahead and do that right now. Alright. Oh yeah, and it's uh, nice is actually uh, really good as you guys can see it's like not letting us kind of stray off anyway so let's go ahead and go the cross jeet echoes a wind blasted sprawl of bottomless ravines latticed with the colossal floatsome of a fallen people excuse me of a people fallen and yeah guys again uh it should be a yep right above my head on this uh scene here uh with uh, absolutely no cost to you 
if you uh, scan the QR code or click the link that is in the chat, you could get the tryout puzzles and survival. It's absolutely, it's a free game that absolutely costs you nothing and just directly supports me. I'd really appreciate it. Cloak and dagger. See where it's going. This time we're doubling up on the fire. With a single helping of ice. Gavin, the others could be in danger as we speak. You're right. I'm sorry. Yote is a fine scout. If Kandor was attacked, she will already have begun gathering information. All right. Tabor isn't far. We should pick up what? pace. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> I was like, it says like there's an enemy, but I didn't see anything. Uh, what do y'all think? Yeah. Here, let's uh, Ambrosia. There you go. Come on. Should have known like uh, there was gonna be much more traveling. I actually didn't pull her out sooner because of that. To cross the ravine. Assuming they would allow it, the echoes have a will of their own. Oh shit! That caught me. Let's uh, go ahead and dismount. You deserve a rest. All right, y'all ready? Ah! Damn it. Oh, well, that's a straight up name. Just Fallen Bug. I mean, I'll take these guys over the Akash enemies. Like, the Akash or Akashaic enemies are a bit. a bit more bothersome. Get some will of the wikes up. Get off. Yeah, I love that because of the continuous damage and it also it also blocks us for damage. I think like each uh white or small fireball, hence the name Will of the Wikes, kinda like has a certain threshold for damage. Here, let's I was trying to yeah, there we go. Don't know why that kind of. There we go. Oh, it's only a punish. I thought it was gonna be a mortal blow with that, with like that little health left. But we'll take it. Tell us about Yote, Joshua. She's strong-willed, loyal. What is that? Deadly. Oh, is something they're flying. But with better manners. Hell diver. Okay. Easy, easy. <laughs> ah, man, you gotta love those. Even if you don't get the mortal blow, they still look really, really good. Easy work. that a merchant perhaps yep there's a merchant are you off to now then bound for the free cities perhaps oh no need to say if you'd rather not we all have our reasons oh is he not actually gonna exactly be able to sell us anything strangers myself at the know truth be told we could do with a bit of inspiration don't know which way to turn no more was doing a roaring trade back in Oriflam. Boy up it to the poor Drake lost her noggin. So, boy join me luck in the desert. Then the fang went the same way. Wait, it's the, the same merchant that's been the there million. for like uh <laughs> like Detroit Camber next. All the crap no we've wonder. been causing. The old place be crawling with orcs before they even say For stuff. a good cause though. As I always say, where there's that's choices, funny. there's opportunity. Opportunity to mint deal, that is. So, where to next? Yo, he gave us like this whole speech and doing all this talking. He, he, he's not even a real merchant, like, you can't buy anything from him. Oh man, I tell you.
Here, let me. I'll just accept it. I won't actually. I won't actually do it. I'll just accept it just to have it. I'll go. Oh, they're over there. Rest well. A little easy, you know. We spiked the hell out of Kuka. It's called bad blood. Ah, okay. I, I see why it's called that. All right, but here, let's uh, continue on. Close. Let's hope the is still there. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I'm pretty sure, like, it's like so close because y'all see that like blue aura to my left. Yeah. Now. We can't go around it. Then we'll just have to be careful. Let's see what this is. Hopefully, it's Gil. Three desert roses. Okay, I'll I'll take material too. Any type of like material or gill, we'll take it. Well, we'll take anything. <laughs> Let's do it. Go ahead and pop this. Ah, that's immortal. Nice. Immortal bow, baby. Easy work. Places I haven't. Is he gonna stop us? Oh, okay. Don't make it in Republic. Where now, Joshua? There is a residence just inside the city gates. She oh, okay, there is a merchant. Okay, but we don't need him though. Uh, you know, we filled up at Karen's right before we left. Okay, I'm so glad those obelisk. I'm, I'm so glad they activate uh, like automatically, because I could see myself forgetting like half of those. Especially like while streaming where I'm trying to like converse and entertain as well as play. My Lord Marquess, it is an honor. I am Yote, Knight of the Undying, charged with the protection of His Grace Joshua Rosfield, Keeper of the Flame of the Phoenix. Of course. It all makes sense now. Does it? Would you care to elaborate? <laughs> the Undying are loyal servants to the Ducal Throne. Or more specifically, to its heir. They have served our family for generations, albeit from the shadows. Hmm. Since their inception, they have been tasked with the preservation and enactment of the rites of ancestral communion. After the events at Phoenix Gate, it was the Undying who delivered me to safety. Hmm. And since the day I left Rosaria, Yote has been my constant companion and protector. Without her sword, I would not have survived my journey across the realm. Rise, Lady Yote. Wow. You saved my brother. I owe you a debt I can never repay. I but did my duty. Come now. Tell us what you've discovered. Your Grace. It is as you feared. The vessel we spied off the coast of the Crystalline Dominion on the night of her fall. It was the Ein Herjar. Beyond any doubt. The Black Galleon. Joshua. The Ein Herjar is the Royalist flagship. What business would they have in the Dominion? Uh, upon learning of Walud's involvement in recent events at Drake's Fang, I sensed the malign influence of Ultima, and bid Yote and the Undying look into the matter. We have reason to believe that the Black Galleon weighed anchor shortly after the fighting <coughs> began, and set a course due south. For Canva? 
Then it is Waluda knights who besiege the cities. What is left of them? Yes. And the black galleon sails at but one man's behest. Barnabas Thar. Ah, oh, there he is. Barnabas. A.K.A. The Dominant of Odin. Are we truly safe here in the Agora? <clears throat> the city guard have been paid, if that's what you're implying. All the more reason for them to run. <laughs> well, you are free to leave, Lord Minister. Markets abandoned, warehouses aflame, blackened hulls choking every port in the capital. Canva is ruined. The realm teeters on the brink of chaos, and all you can think about is commerce. Forgive us. We were not aware Dalmechia now subsisted on charity. How dare you! Distinguished members of the council. You must forgive his majesty. It's just a little bit of me. I uh, thought that was Dion from the bottom of the trousers, what but I was like, no, that wait, that what is the can't be. Of this? A trifle crazy. Yeah, we saw him very early on in the stream quite a few months ago i feel like so okay we now know very well he's with barnabas aka the dominant of odin do you not see the king he has come to save us from the akashi It's a gift from the heavens, divine intervention, our very salvation. And of course, if it is compensation he requires, we would be most willing to negotiate a fair price for services rendered. Fools. <laughs> Your ignorance unbecomes you. He's like the audacity. Majesty, correct me if I'm wrong, but I would swear that the fiends washing the cobbles of Canva with the blood of her citizens wear the colors of Walud. So you do not deny it. Guards, better them, and see our guests to the dungeons. Oh, well, that's not gonna go the way they think that's gonna go. Enough. Holy shit. still here somewhere in the city her consciousness fair dripping with her late father's hubris a consciousness to which muthos inextricably bound and inexorably drawn see that he is made welcome yes your majesty come muthos Surely the prince's light cannot have sated you. Damn, gotta admit, uh, Bahamut. Well, all the damn icon and dominant like fights have been crazy, but uh, I'm, I'm really looking forward to Odin's. So then. How long has Walud been under Ultima's control? How long indeed? Based on what we know of Barnabas's actions, I would guess some few years, mayhap more. But to what end? What does Ultima want? The tapestry. Show them. Oh yeah. 
I do remember that. Gate, Drake's breath, and now here. But what is it? It is old, ancient, even. Naught remains of the faith it represents, save what can be gleaned from the image itself. None could tell me what the one in the apolytry meant. Even the undying. But I believe it may be the key to discerning Ultima's purpose. That figure in the center, the one beneath whom the icons congregate, that I believe to be Ultima. He is I can a god, see that, yeah. At least godlike. His very existence beyond our ken. The icons, and by extension their dominance, are meant to be his subjects. Oh and wow. While some, like Barnabas, have accepted this role. And we did see that Barnabas from an earlier stream. Him, like you, Clive. Which is rather inconvenient, as it appears he needs you most of all. And gods don't like to be disobeyed. No. I don't suppose they do. Clive, may I tell Yote of the lake? By all means. About the hideaway? Yote, I will be ah, accompanying okay, okay. my brother to the free cities. <laughs> Whilst we are afield, I would have you watch over those Clive has made his wards. Omia lost Delan to his sad Lily. Though well concealed, the hideaway lacks trained fighters to defend its occupants yep. should they be discovered. But it is my duty to... As it has ever been my brother's duty. Remember. If, if that is your wish, your grace, but please be safe. If aught were to befall you, I... You have my word. Not talking about taking her job seriously, right? My lord, my lady. We are in your debt, Yote. <clears throat> Let's find our friends. Right. <clears throat> it's plain she cares for you very deeply. And I her, which is why I had to let her go. Opportunity beckons. You're actually, again, guys, I'm going to try my best to just focus on the story and not get sidetracked. I really want to go ahead and finish this in time because I have to not to uh, start Suicide Squad, kill the Justice League so late. But I will be collecting these along the way as I go, just to have them all collected. And eventually, I'd like to get around to doing them. Elder Dread Evis had been sighted in the field. Dread Evis, I uh, heard you want to say. Dread e bring me. <laughs> Sounds like, uh, yeah, okay, it's a hunt. <laughs> All right. All right. Glad I picked that one of up. Course, leave hmm. I eagerly await you. Again, we'll we'll still focus on the story. I won't prioritize prioritize any of the side quests right now. Okay. And I don't think we need anything from the merchant, but let me just Buying, check and see what he's got. But yeah, nothing crazy, so. New song for the hideaway. No way in hell I'm going to dump 20, 20k for that. Of course. Go safely. I mean, I feel like eventually I will. I'm sure there's like some sort of trophy behind, you know, doing it, so. Oh, who's this? Oh, damn. Is it? No, it can't be. Cyril. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> How fares the search? Well, your grace, my report shall be with you ere long. Ah, 
Ah, yes. Yote is otherwise engaged at my behest. And the duty of wardenship? Fulfilled. For as you see, I've been reunited with my first shield. I am Cyril, Knight of the Undying and bearer of the Burning Quill. Charged with chronicling the mortal deeds of his grace, Joshua Rosfield. Keeper of the Flame of the Phoenix and rightful Archduke of Rosaria. I entrusted Cyril here with overseeing the investigation into Ultima's origins. Findings from his brothers and sisters afield are delivered here to be collated and catalogued. Hmm. Just how many undying are there? Not nearly enough, Milady. So it seems that Josh has been busy over these years that we've we thought he was dead. He's got like a really good loyal group of people behind him, seems. Our creed. I see. You have your associates, I have mine. But you may now think of them as ours. That won't be a problem, will it? The Phoenix is our sun, and we but the shadows that quicken in his radiance. It is from the darkness that we serve, both him and now you. Oh no, that one's kind of weird. This token. <laughs> oh nice. Okay, I feel bad for calling him weird. For as long as you bear it, members of our order will reveal themselves unto you. If there is nothing further. No. You are dismissed. Your grace. Canvas. We'll talk about this later. <laughs> yeah, I could tell. Like, uh, it was that particular one. The uh, Yote was okay. You certainly keep strange bedfellows, Josh. <laughs> right. Onward to Canver. You know what? Here, let us go ahead and. Oh, not okay. I think we're too close. All right. Build a path. Let's go ahead. Let's go it by Chocobo here. You know, for this one to like not be fully open world, uh, open zone, it, it, you know, they're not, the zones aren't small, so. Oh, wow. We haven't seen orcs in a while. Gotcha. Ah, let's get it. Trying to like do good with these and get like some crazy combos to make some clips for you guys and post them on YouTube shorts and TikTok. <laughs> he rolled right into that one. Oh! Nice. You guys want me to go ahead and here? I'll just go ahead and launch it. I mean, I really like that, but I feel like you can only get like a crazy benefit from it when it's a certain type of enemy. Like if there's a multi-hitting enemy, like that, like fires like something ranged, and you can get that dodge off, and, and you could get the maximum uh, fourth level charge for the Bahamut Mega Flare fairly quickly. So I, I don't recommend doing that. All the time because you'll kind of like just be sitting there waiting for them to swing or something like that, you know. Wow, I took a lot. Can we get a? Is he going to get up? Nope. There we go. Mortal blow, baby. <laughs> so crazy, even when it's just a punish, you know. Right, that one's gonna be a mortal blow. He's way too low to survive that. Gotcha. Uh, let's go ahead and get this guy. Pretty quick. Or low, sorry. Alright. Easy work. Okay, I'm assuming that's Canver here. Definitely looks like a city. Smoke. Is the city full? Oh damn. Okay, is that there yeah, there's the obelisk, so all right. The 
three men are still holding their own, then. Do we have any idea where Gav and the others might be? There's a warehouse near the docks where we agreed to meet if there was any trouble. Okay. We should hurry. Yeah, come to think of it, we haven't seen Gav in quite some time. Quite a few streams ago, actually. Especially back when we do the two-hour streams. Okay. Alright, let's uh, go ahead and enter the free city of Canver here. Gilded Path. That's Tabor. That's, uh, don't forget, we got some side quests there. So, Alright, let's do this. Old Canver. Sounds like thunder. You late. <laughs> I think you'd stumbled off a cliff. I seem to recall that was you, Gav. Good to see you. Any trouble on the road? Nothing we couldn't handle. Was that our uncle? I knew you'd come. There's mid. Is that who I think it is? Yes. Uh, allow me to introduce my brother, Joshua. Clyde's told me all about you. How are even listening most of the time? Name's Midadol, but everyone calls me Mid. My lady. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Damn, that Final Fantasy Riz. Okay, yeah, I was like, I thought I saw our uncle there. I know I wasn't tripping. There he is. My boy. Uncle Byron. <laughs> it's really you. I never thought I'd see the day. <laughs> so these Akashic are being controlled. That's what it looked like. Empty eyes, eerie blue glow. No doubt they were turned. Silent as monks, every last one of them. Your man here speaks true, Clive. We saw more than a few in the city. They moved in ranks with a purpose, and not of their own. What's that? Ultimus Some, doing? Like, and downsides of like having an office. I mean, it's like you gotta dust it daily, city. at least, or every few days. Especially like when you're OCD. Mostly, but not all. A handful managed to lock themselves well, in their villas before the perfectly placed arrived. somewhere. Some in the merchant's district to the west, and a few of us on the far bank. Hmm. If the Akashic stumble across either hiding place, a few bolted doors won't hold them for long. We need to find them, and quickly. What do you propose? We split into two parties. Okay. I will make for the merchant's district, while you look to those across the river. Mind keeping an eye on my brother? Not at all. Oh, nice. Okay, so. We find the villa and try the He's gonna come entrance. with us. Understood. Probably our uncle Byron. And what of us? Mid, is she fit to sail? The ship? Uh, the Mithril engine could probably do with a few more tweaks. Then you better work fast. Yeah, I was about to say, you're not giving us like you that run around quest again. In time. They'll never make it to the hideaway on foot. Okay, okay. You leave that to me. See that Mid doesn't get herself into trouble, would you? Think I can manage that? I'll keep him safe. Looks like you stuck with me, Byron. That's Lord Rossfield, you little gutter snipe. <laughs> I forgot they were beefing. It's funny. Shall we then? And you keep Clyde safe. Be careful. Both of you. You too. All 
All right. So yeah, clearly like something happened here. So all right, even fall. Okay. And there. Okay. So something serious is about to happen. Progress from certain quests is limited. Okay. Wait a minute. Right, Toggle. Let's find those survivors. Wow. Uh, they don't stand a chance against those things. Is it Kashik, right? Oh yeah. Holy crap. Oh, the, oh orcs! Here, let's uh, yeah, let's go for it. Let's hide away. Let's get it. Gotta choose one hit, sir. Goodbye. You as well. Quick work for us. Oh no, there's some Akashic as well. Uh, let's get it. It's gotta be a okay, hails it. It's gotta be a mortal blow. Come on, get out of that. Take it. Okay, that was a good hit. Where is he? He's quick. Right time. Crap. Take it. Thunder, fire. <laughs> Take it. Oh, that's half stagger, baby. That was pretty, pretty crazy DPS just then. Okay. No. Oh, don't want to get hit by that. Wow. I'm trying to focus down. You know something I always forget in this? Because I barely use it. Where is it? There we go. The lock on. Yeah, okay, I thought it was L1. Okay, this guy. Alright, there we go. We got the stagger. Think to put up our will of the likes any sooner to block some of that damage, but also at the same time, it was like I had a brain fart on the on the targeting system there. But we're all good. Gotcha. Get it. Get your ass. All right. A small slip up, but we got it. Alright, who's next? Oh, nice. There's something here. Hopefully, it's a potion. Yep. Because I definitely didn't want to use as many as I did just then. Looks like there's some more orcs here. There's some white right. Alright, let's get it. Oh, no. Let's get this one. Nice. Wait, here. Let's uh, get a. There we go. Nice. Get that punish on him. Not quite a mortal blow. But definitely worth it, I would say. Okay, I think this will take down that protect easily. Let's get it. Well, actually, who was that? Okay, it's this thing casting the protect. You. Okay, there we go. That should take care of that. Oh no, there's another one. Oh no, here we gotta use some magic to get that off. Is there another one that I'm missing? Oh, okay, yeah, there's another one. Don't want him casting that on the whole crew, you know? Alright, there we go, though. Add up our cool little wikes here. There we go, nice. Mortal Blow, can we get it? Okay, I didn't do the animation, but it's all good. Still kicking ass. Big Tom. 
Okay, that's that. Got the level up. 37, baby. Nice. What happened to the Royal Army? We got That's here three bloody hides. Also, I've been slipping on this lately, but I haven't seen anything, but I just want to make sure that we don't miss a chest. Which I feel like they're not common, but when we do get them, they're definitely worth it. So. Alright. Yeah, this way. Let's get it. Oh no. Okay, we're going up. I was like, this is gonna be a tight fight. Uh, speaking of chest, we got one. Sensibles of steel silk, bloody eyes, and sharp fangs. Nice. Steel silk is such a tongue twister to me. Steel silk. Anything else? I'm not seeing anything. I'm not seeing anything. Yeah, that's a dead end. All right, let's uh, get up here. <laughs> oh, Royal Mastiff reminds me of that dog, uh, Boss Mastiff from Scarlet and Violet Pokemon. No, 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 no! All right, there we go. Ha! Take it. With the beautiful hashtag, it's so quick too. Let's get it. Come on, baby. Let's get it. Yeah, let's uh, try to make quick work with this guy. Good jump before his stagger was up, but not quite enough to kill him. Oh, that was a big hit. Wow. Okay. Don't want to get hit by too many of those. Or that. Or that. What is this? Is this health? Yep. Oh, bloody hides. Okay. Yeah, let's go ahead and try to charge this. Woo. That. He still got us. Alright, there we go. There we go. Okay, there we go. We, we phased that out with a perfectly timed Will of the Whites. That huge hit that he does. Nice. With another stagger. Here, let's go ahead and quick break. Wow. Here, let's try to get this. I think that'll do it. Nice. That will. Alright. Going towards this way. But uh, actually, guys, uh, for tonight, it's coming up on an hour. I'm going to stop here uh, at about an hour. But uh, before I go, you know, as always, if you're here, you know, until the end like this, uh, I really appreciate your support. It uh, means a lot to me. And uh, also, we do have a new campaign. It's for a game called Puzzles and Survival. You know, at no cost to you, you know, just download the game. Check the link in the chat. Use a QR code above me to scan it no cost to you it directly supports the channel and with that support i'm able to you know bring you guys more playthroughs and better quality streams uh, without further ado you all have a nice night